the goal of, of this system was to have a flying antenna platform where we can put any kind of antenna on the, on the drone and do any kind of RF testing without actually having a stationary antenna. The way it was done before was we set up an antenna in just one spot and we probed at just one spot. Well, when the system under test or the SUT arrives in the chamber, um, that RF is, is everywhere and we want to test to see what kind of environment um, the, the, the SUT is in. And we didn't have that capability before. Uh, the drone can actually maneuver itself in the whole volume of where the SUT occupies. We had to make sure that the drone has unlimited loiter time with appropriate payload. And that, provide, that is provided by the tether. Number two is we have to make sure that the drone does not interfere with RF that we're trying to measure. And if we are measuring uh, in the chamber GPS environment and the drone would operate off of GPS, that would kill the whole, the whole thing. So the, we, we designed a custom uh, positioning system that doesn't rely on GPS and yet it will still maintain accurate positioning of the drone. Um, as well as any kind of uh, RF noise emission from the drone electronics and the motors, they also have to be um, somehow shielded so that the drone doesn't interfere with anything that we're trying to measure. So current configuration is about 50% complete. Not all the sensors are connected. The propellers will be a little bit bigger just to account for, uh, some, for unknown unknowns. We, still, we haven't flown it yet, and uh, we want to know that when we want to make sure that when we do fly, we get the maximum performance possible out of this current configuration.